I have been trying to get this fly for fucking days now. And it keeps flying into my frame while I'm trying to film. Bitch. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I'm back today with a review video for you guys. Today's review is going to be not on any makeup products, but on a hair product. So this brand reached out to me a few weeks ago. I want to say maybe like a month a month and a half maybe ago but anyways today's review is going to be on this product from the brand Asavea I think it's called I'm not exactly sure the pronunciation I apologize if I'm pronouncing that wrong and this is a hair straightener brush now I've seen this product used so many times However, to me, I've always been a skeptic about this kind of a product just because it feels so gimmicky to me. So this was actually going to be the product that I knew I wanted to work on just because I wanted to see if it actually does work. So this one is the pink and black one, which I saw the pink one. I was like, girl, I need that in my life. Now, of course, this is going to be a first impression, but unlike makeup, I feel like products like these are kind of easy to really get a good impression on with the first try because it's a hair product, you know what I mean? When it comes to makeup, your skin does take some time to get used to the new product. So you're not really sure right off the bat, right out of the gate, how it's going to react to your skin. But with hair care products such as these, you can pretty much instantaneously tell whether or not it's going to be a good product or a bad product. My hair gets frizzy like that, especially when it's humid outside, which it has been over the past few days. Here in the Adirondacks, we've had a steady stream of non-stop thunderstorms, rain, bad winds, lightning, hail. It's just been nasty outside, and so my hair has been taking a beating from the humidity because on the days when it's not raining, but it's still going to rain during the day, it obviously gets very humid and the air is very sticky and just nasty. So my hair takes a beating from that, unfortunately, but I generally try to use products that kind of combat frizziness. This is the Garnier Fructis Style Frizz Guard Anti-Frizz Dry Spray. I swear by this stuff because this is the only reason why my hair is not a frizzy mess right now, I promise you that. I absolutely love this. So if you're someone with very, very frizzy hair naturally, buy this. It's like $4, I think it's some change at Walmart, very inexpensive. But anyways, like I said, I'm using the hair straightener brush with anti-static technology and it's says here that it retails originally for $60, but you can get it right now for $29.99, which is the reason why I chose it, because if I was going to buy anything from this brand or work with anything from this brand, I wanted to make sure that it would be something affordable for all of you guys here on my channel, because I know that some of you guys cannot afford the really extravagant hair things, which I'm one of them, girl. I mean, I could afford it if I really wanted to, but I'm going to be honest, I don't really do much with my hair outside of straightening it on rare occasions and curling it which that happens naturally, so I don't really see a need to invest in a very, very expensive hair straightening, hair curling item, so I wanted to make sure this would be very affordable for you guys as well. But yes, the best place to start for a first impressions is to show you guys the product I normally use. This is the Remington Wet to Straight Hair Straightener, and I honestly have been using this straightener for so long. I absolutely love this hair straightener. I love how quick it's able to straighten my hair because my my hair is, first of all, very thick. I have a lot of hair, like a ton of it, so it takes a long time for me to curl my hair, to straighten it, no matter what I do, but I found with this hair flat iron, my hair straightening process is cut in half, which is why I absolutely love this. So it's going to be very hard for me to kind of stray away from what I normally know and love and use something that I've never ever tried before in my life, but we're going to do it today. All right, so let's get to the claims here on the website, which I will have linked down below for you guys. So it says here, this product has anti-static and anti-skull technology, and it says it's easy to use. The Asavea hair straightener brush enables you to straighten your hair much faster than a flat iron. The heated ceramic plates help to straighten your hair quickly without you having to worry about burning or damaging your hair. Now, that is going to be the first little, like, con for me when it comes to this product because as someone who has gone to beauty school I know a lot about hair I may not know everything there is to know about hair but the one thing I do know is no matter what you do no matter what temperature you're using on a flat iron or curling iron no matter what you do you are causing damage to your hair when you apply heat to it so it kind of irks me when 
brands will advertise their products as products that will not damage your hair because the more honest approach to that kind of a claim would be to say will not significantly cause damage to your hair because no matter what temperature you have on your curling iron your flat iron whatever the case may be you are causing a small amount of damage or a large amount of damage to your hair unfortunately there is no getting around causing damage to your hair using heat styling tools. It's unavoidable. It's going to happen. What matters is how you take care of your hair before and after. So yeah, that's going to be my first negative because I, I, I that's the one thing I absolutely hate is when brands will advertise that on their products. So inside the box, I didn't notice this till just now, there was a little note here and it says here, if there is any reason you wouldn't rate this a five star experience, please let us know right away and we'll do what we can to make it right. Now, I wish more brands had that outlook uh, as you guys know, especially here in the beauty community when it comes to like, especially like makeup products. Brands don't have that outlook on certain things. They don't want you to tell them and take it as constructive criticism. They want to attack you for it and not make it right and still sell shit product. So that's fun. Which I think is pretty cruddy because the reason why you send these products to these influencers is because you want them to give you reviews on the product from their perspective as the consumers. That way, if there are any problems, you can make it right. But in most cases, as you guys have seen many, many times here in this community, a lot of the brands don't take the constructive criticism the best way and in turn just cut ties with that person or or call them out on social media you know the mess that comes from that kind of crap so it's very refreshing to see a brand that actually cares about what we have to say as a consumer so that is definitely a big plus one for me so the power options are right here on the side excuse my nails by the way is just hair dye it's not dirty so we're gonna go ahead and press that as you can see it pops on and the starting temperature is 180 and you can see right here it increases pretty quickly i should say for a hair styling tool i mean i've seen some that go pretty quickly but that's pretty fast so while that's heating up to 180 degrees we're gonna go through this and see if there's any like special ways we should be using it things we shouldn't do when we use it things like that. All right, so it says here, instructions for hair straighteners. Different settings of the Asavea hair straightener can provide you with various temperature settings to obtain straight hair. It is recommended that you select the highest temperature at first and then decrease the temperature level based on your hair quality. For thicker hair, 210 to 230 degrees Celsius is recommended. For common hair, what is common hair? For common hair, whatever that is, 190 to 210 degrees Celsius is recommended. For thin hair, 170 degrees to 200 degrees Celsius is recommended. So, for me, since I have a lot of hair, it's very thick. It says 210 degrees, so we're going to go ahead and pick this up and start to push the plus button, and I can already feel the heat coming off of it, so that's really heating up quickly. When the straightener is on, press the on-off key, lock key, one time, and the hair straightener will be locked. It will be unlocked when you press the key again. When it is locked, the LCD screen will display lock. So the lock mechanism, I think, is very smart because the number one thing that kind of annoys me when it comes to using this one is the fact that this is a spinning mechanism when it comes to temperature changes. So every time I straighten my hair, say I go to straighten it and my finger accidentally slips this down or up, obviously it's going to become way too hot or not hot enough to straighten my hair and then I'm just trying to figure out if my straightener is just going to crap or if it's just the temperature being changed, which is obviously a very quick fix. But even still, it's one of the things that just kind of stink about these kind of things because the buttons are usually placed somewhere on the handles here. And that can become a problem when it comes to temperatures changing without you knowing. So the fact they have a lock mechanism for this product, I think is very, 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 very smart. All right. So it says here we are at the 210 degrees that it instructed us to get to. I smell a faint scent of like burning plastic, but I'm assuming that's only because it's my first time using it. I'm assuming that will go away with use. So we're going to go ahead and uh, try this out for the first time. I'm kind of nervous, I got to say. This product is the half hour off function. It turns off after 30 minutes of using, so please start it up when you use it once more. So that's another thing that I think is pretty cool because the number one thing that I do not like about this is that after a certain amount of time, it does not shut off. Like, it just stays on. It says the less amount of hair you use, the less amount of time it's going to take to straighten it. So we're going to just put that through. And... 
I mean, that's straight. As you can see, my hair has like a curl to it naturally. So it takes me a little while, especially when it comes to like these baby hairs up top. It takes me a little while to really get those to straighten out a little bit. I mean, that is straightening it. <laughs> All right, so let's go ahead and pick up a bigger amount now. We'll go slow because obviously it's a bigger chunk of hair. Wow. I have to admit, I was very skeptical. I thought it was kind of gimmicky at first. I didn't think it would actually do what it said it was going to do. But it's straightening my hair. You guys are watching it straighten my hair. Alright, so as you can see, my hair is straightened for the most part. There are some little kinks here and there that haven't gotten straightened as well as easily as my flat iron would be able to straighten them. We're going to go ahead and continue on with the straightening process. We're going to do the left side of my head. I'm going really slowly and you're watching it straighten that hair. I don't know guys, this might be my new thing. This is so cool. super super impressed with this product I have to say my Remington might just be put on the back burner for this girl I just I, there's like there's no words like you guys saw my hair being straightened in front of your faces in front of your very eyes with this brush this is probably the coolest product I think I've ever tried ever I would definitely recommend this to you guys. You guys know I'm very picky, like I said in the beginning of the video, I'm very picky about what I recommend to you guys because I, unlike these other influencers here on YouTube, I'm not someone who can be paid to give a good review, you know what I mean? Like, these companies aren't running to me to feature me on any of their websites or whatever the case may be. I don't have coupon codes or anything like that. If I try a product, it's because I'm genuinely interested in trying the product itself. And I have to say, I am so glad I went with this company and said yes to trying this product out because I think I just found my new favorite straightening tool. Like, this is so cool. So guys, I mean, what is there to argue about this product? It works. It My hair looks great. It delivered what it said it was going to deliver. I will have the link to this product down below for you guys if you are interested in picking it up. However, Asavea was nice enough to actually grant me a giveaway option as well if I liked the product, which I think is something that's really cool too because not very many brands would be like, if you like our product and it's something you think you would use for yourself, and you would recommend to your subscribers, we will also give you a giveaway option, which I am totally going to opt into that because I would love for you guys to have a chance to win one of these because I love it. I will get more details on the giveaway in the next few days for you guys, and when I do get those details, double check down below for them in the drop bar. But uh, yeah. 10 out of 10 for me. I would totally recommend it for you guys. Alright guys, I'm gonna get on out of here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Any questions, leave those all down below. And I will see you guys in my next video. I love you guys so much. Bye.